Greetings, Clashers. This is Galadon. I've just completed an hour and a half of meditation, bringing down my heart rate and my metabolism, and calming myself to prepare for Clan Wars Live. Yes, it's time. Galadon's going to do it again. I've got my angina medication at hand, and we are going to try a live Clan War attack in a very close war. All right, here we go with my second war attack of this war against Crucible Wrath. Uh, I just finished my first one where I managed a two-star base, and it was pretty smooth, I got to admit. But unfortunately, I forgot to record the video. I had all the audio, but not the video, and I just don't think it would work to try to match it up with a replay. You guys would be like, man, what the heck is he up to? So we're just going to go ahead and go with the second attack here of two in this war. And uh, we've got all of our troops queued up. I grabbed a couple of balloons this time, and you'll see why in a minute. Clan Castle isn't full. Um, not a lot of people on right now, but I, we're only missing a couple of barbarians there. Uh, normally I would queue up troops for the next attack, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. We're just going to grab these guys and go to this base up here. Mr. Bojangles, he was attacked for one star by C-Dub77. Now, C-Dubs is just as good of an attacker as I am, so uh, I wanted to see what happened here. And um, this is the second time I've watched this replay because I studied it like a good student. And I saw that he used a couple of balloons, so that's why I'm bringing balloons. I thought I'd just copy him. That was a pretty good idea. Uh, as we fast forward through the rest of it here, we'll see that the, the beginning of the attack works out pretty well. He's got those conclosures open, the golems in. He lightnings the clan castle, just like Galadon would do. And the last golem, all the wall breakers. And then here comes the problem. There they go. King and queen going to go around the outside rather than down the middle because he just didn't quite clear enough surrounding structures there. They got a little bit distracted by the shiny gold mines. So um, we are just going to try to avoid that. Everything else was pretty good. He got 72%. Um, so we are just going to confirm that we are going to try to take the second star this time. And uh, we are going to make sure we have all of our troops here, all of our spells, just in case. I've done it before. And we're going to grab the king first and just activate him and once we woken him up way over there we'll start work on the right and uh, we'll uh, try to take out the mortar and the tesla with this hog rider and these balloons to okay no should have put the hog rider by the mortar because the hog riders oh god i hate it when this happens okay so the mortar's there and we are committed this attack so i'm going to try to get rid of the mortar here in a minute i'm going to drop a golem after i pull the queen come on after the barbarians the golem Okay, there we go, and the clan castle. Now this should work. We take the queen out and the mortar and the king hopefully next. And now we can. I'm just going to kind of start the rest of the attack like I normally would here. Wall breakers and stuff like that. And um, let's see, spray some wizards out, start taking out structures. Notice that we did not manage to take out that wall down there. Uh, so we're going to drop a couple more wall breakers to get it out. Here comes the clan castle troops. Let's get that lightning spell ready here and try to get them to bunch up on a golem. And uh, the witch is on the move. Come on, lightning spell. Let's get her. Okay. Uh, it looks like we got her. We're going to drop the last golem down there. A um, couple of test wall breakers before we drop all the wall breakers and try to get deep in towards the uh, clan castle. So we're going to do that. We're going to get the king and the queen down here. We're going to drop that rage spell right there. And hopefully they're all going to go right straight to the town hall. Like, no, the, okay, the king and the queen on left, left. Oh, okay. Well, okay, that's not too bad. Here comes the king. Right in, takes out that inferno. And we are, that is a terrible placement of the free spell. But we've got a star. Uh, we activated the queen's special ability. It's total mayhem in here right now. I'm just trying to... <laughs> okay, so... It looks like we're okay, 42%. Heroes are pretty much alive right now. We've got a few troops left. We should be okay. Um, things, well, oh, they're both way down in health. So we're going to have to try to help them out somehow here. Um, oh man, come on, 45%. Let's see if we can't get the queen to take out a few structures more quickly here. Freeze those guys that are getting her. Maybe she can just... What? No, 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 where are you going? The cannons are right there. She's... Oh, come on. Just typical, okay. Race against the clock. Go ahead. Come on. 49 and 50. Thank you. Second star. End the attack. Slow the heart rate. <sighs> All right. So one more star for the good guys. Pull slightly further ahead uh, from Crucible Wrath. I'm going to take a look here at the war log. You'll see that this was my second attack. And uh, war log. Here we go. War events. 
And uh, there was the first one against Wales. I did grab a second star there as well. Also stopped at 50%, had no chance at three stars. Uh, this is a very close uh, clan war. It's going to be interesting to see what happens. But uh, good luck, Crucible Wrath. You'll need it because Lost Phoenix is on full attack. All right, thank you very much for watching. Again, please do like, subscribe, and leave your comments. I'm going to go get my prescriptions refilled, sign up for a yoga class, and I'll see you soon.